This is an installation on eight washers and dryers. They happen to be speed queens, which are real easy. They're the coin slide versions. So we have in this row, uh, washers and one dryer. And then over here, we've got three more dryers. Then our plan of action is going to be putting the machine on the wall, the 5008. So the 5008 will be bolted in with molly bolts. And the end result, we're gonna drop down to that raceway in the bottom so the wires and everything are hidden. Okay, crossed. Okay, and we have electricity in the back. We're gonna pick up. Inside each of the machines is a coin slide that we're gonna to connect to to turn on the washers. End of this video. Our next step is going to be drilling holes, which you see here, to mount the Model 5008 8 selection. Stop again. Inside the coin mechanism area, you have the momentary coin switch that when the switch goes back and is activated each time the lever goes back, that triggers and starts the machine. You generally will find a red and white wire, which you can see there in the video, where we're going to splice in order to tap into to be able to trigger. We're going to fool this washer to think it's made a payment. Now I've removed the micro switch, making it ready for me to splice in the two wires. Now we've spliced in the two wires to the red and white, and it's been routed through the back of the machine here from the coin mechanism back down through an open hole. And I'm going to put a tie wrap on that to secure it so it can't move or fray in any way. Now this completes the installation of the wiring harness to the slide coin switch. We put the tie wrap on, snip that off, put the screws back in, snap the little locks on, and reassemble everything back to original. In the event you desire to remove the coin mechanism, you only have one hex bolt, unloosen that, it comes out, and then you can lift the coin mechanism, lift it up and out, and Lowe's and Home Depot will cut you a piece of plastic that fits into this area right here, an adhesive, and it looks like it came from the factory. And then put back the screws and the plates and the switch. It's now fully assembled, ready for use. Okay, we've installed it on the wall, ready to hook up the cables. Okay, we're ready to test the number two washer. We've already tested the number one washer. So as soon as the NIAC boots up, we're going to take our pass card. And we're going to go over there and make a vent. Okay, we're making payment. And we're push number two. It's sending over a pulse now to the machine. The machine is now on. It says in use. I need a little water on the Yep. So number two is operational. This completes our installation. Other than tidying it up and make it look fancy by running um, tubing, things like that, to conceal the wires and cables. So this concludes our demonstration of how to install a Venmo model 5008, eight selection push button payment systems for washers and dryers. Thank you.